Now, as you may have heard, Marvel and Netflix recently struck an unprecedented television deal, specifically to tell the stories of great Marvel characters that you see behind me. And if you're a Marvel fan, you already know that these characters hail from New York City, Hell's Kitchen specifically, a setting that we believe is just as important to their stories as the characters themselves. And today, I am very pleased to announce that they will be filming all of these series right here in New York City and making it possible for us to have the ultimate authentic backdrop for this epic Marvel series. I got to say that as a born and bred New Yorker, uh, words can't really describe, first of all, the fact that I'm here, and secondly, the fact uh, just how excited I am that Daredevil and the Defenders are going to be shooting right here in New York City, not just my hometown, but really their hometown as well. See, back in 1962, Stan Lee by the way, also another born and bred New Yorker, along with a team of legendary writers and artists, began creating what we kind of know now as the beginnings of the Marvel Universe. I think it's fair to say that everything about Marvel since that day has really been made in New York. Uh, and outside of Spider-Man, I think that Daredevil and Defenders uh, are probably the most synonymous characters with New York City. In our comics, over the last five decades, Daredevil and Defenders have used New York City as their playground. So I think it's only fitting that we're shooting right here in this city. Um, and much like our comics, New York City really plays as big a role as any hero or villain. Since 1962, New York City has been the canvas on which we have written, drawn, and built all of our stories. And I think with today's announcement, that tradition is going to continue. Uh, but it's in a whole new way. But what's important is we get to build them right here in the exact same city that inspired and really bore all these characters. So thank you very much, and thank you, Governor. To be in the world of superheroes is very cool. And it just occurred to me as I was sitting here, there's a sequel here, Joe. I can see it. Boy from Queens. <laughs> goes to Albany to fight the evil empire and bring justice to the people of the state. Make some notes. <laughs> Stan Lee wrote a column for a period of time, and at the end of his column, he would sign off every column with the word Excelsior, which is also the state's motto, meaning ever upwards. Uh, and that's, that's the note that I will end on today. Hey guys, Ryan Panagos, aka Marvel's Agent M here. We just had the amazing Defenders news come out at this big press conference. We had Governor Cuomo here, we had Joe Quesada, our Chief Creative Officer, and we had Disney's Bob Iger here. We announced that Marvel's shows on Netflix, the Defenders, Jessica Jones, Daredevil, Luke Cage, Iron Fist, uh, they'll all be filming in New York City. It's going to be a, it's going to be a great three years. Uh, it, what do you want to say, Jeff? I'm, say, I'm just saying, cool, cool. Your breath on my neck feels I'm wonderful. Uh, so it's going to be awesome. We're really excited about it. Uh, stay tuned for tons more news, casting news, all kinds of fun stuff. Right. Lots more on Marvel.com real soon. Stay tuned.